Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Jedi Knight, Jedi Academy. We're still in the middle of this level, and it's been a <laughs> it's been a while since the last session. So, uh... A Jedi. Ooh, they see me. Okay, I'll try to, uh... I'm trying to bait him to come to me. Yes, he did. Oh no! Oh, no. Yes, I can. Ooh, crap, yeah. Alright, and it's been... Oh, alright. <laughs> that went badly. What the hell is my pose over there? <laughs> yeah, so it's been a while. It's been a while since the, uh... Uh, since the last session, so... Yeah, I'm gonna be a bit rusty. Actually, I just remembered something. Uh, so this weapon is completely useless here, but I remember that you can actually use this to... Okay, he still pushed it away. Alright, he's dead. Oh god. Ooh! God damn it. Ugh. Oh crap. Okay. Yeah, this is this was this is a bad idea. Yeah. I was wondering if there was any I don't suppose there are any health power-ups over here. They're gonna use their force lightning on. You won't get far. Well, fuck me then. Man. Okay. I knew this was gonna be a rough one go going in, but I didn't honestly. I did not honestly expect it to be this tough. Okay, he's dead. Okay. I'm uh, gonna back up. Okay. Uh. Man, this guy is. All right. All right. I guess I gotta save there. <laughs> Man. Not saber fun. All right. So, like I was saying. Oh yeah. Another funny thing, uh, while I'm healing here, because I am not going to continue until I've finished, until I'm fully healed. Uh, actually, I think there's a checkpoint after this, so that will be a slight relief. And, uh, wait a minute, is that... I think it's full, yeah. And there, of course, there's another guy just waiting there. Yeah, so... I talked about that Ewok review video, uh, a Jedi. or my review of the Ewok, Ewok movies, and it actually is still up. Uh, I was a little surprised. I, d I didn't watch it. I didn't, I didn't really have the uh, a burning desire to do so, because that was in the pre-video capture days when I when all my movie reviews were just still images. And some videos I still do with just still images because there are certain companies that just love to fuck you over. All right, I actually do like the hard style a lot. I, I, I'm regret. I'm now beginning to think I should have taken. Yes. Okay, that was the checkpoint. All right. So the thing that I was trying to do, you can actually. Uh, oh no. Yeah, it's a good that that grip is actually good for distracting and if you're fast enough you can throw them off. Yeah, so So, you know, that All right, let's now see what happens when you throw shoot one of these guys with the rocket. Okay, that green guy died. I think that other guy died too. Okay. Uh, this this part sucks. You have to. Oh. You end up taking damage. Oh. Whoops. Okay, I screwed that part up. Oh, am 
I supposed to get over there? All right, yeah. So this is the good part about the force grip when you can just drop people off. Oh yeah, I think I must have left one. You can't escape. Or is it, is he is that is, is that him? All right. Yeah, so there there are easy ways to kill these guys as well. Yeah, so Yeah, th those <laughs> and that's the last thing he got to say. The Jedi are here. This place is amazing. Yeah, these green force users. I think all they do is push you and then, you know, occasionally... I, I, I think they also force choke you. I'm pretty sure. But yeah, they've been doing a really poor job of it. Oh, great. How am I going to get down there without breaking my neck? Yeah, there's a, there's a couple of different ways to get down here. And I... Uh, this is one where you keep using these things to uh, hop around. Oh god, this is... Oh, this is legitimately terrifying. <laughs> oh god. Alright. And I think... Yeah, and that's where you have to do the four speed. Die, Jedi. Oh, I hit the green guy. Yeah, having the high ground in a lightsaber fight is not... Oh. Is not advantageous at all. I thought he died. Or was there another green guy? He might have jumped down from the bridge. Like, they sometimes do those super jumps. Yeah, this is not started... Well, sorry about that. Uh, I'll try to uh, do a better job in a minute. Also, I use up a lot of force power doing that jump. Oh, it's just, it's just one guy then. Alright, he's dead. Okay, and I better save here because uh, there are a couple more guys a lot left there. Alright, here we go. Oh god, yeah, here they come. Oh, there was a checkpoint. <laughs> All right, but, but at least at least I made it to the checkpoint. That's that's at least good. You won't get far. Actually, this is a yeah. You can. How good you are. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. All right, yeah. Sometimes it's just easier to cheat. <laughs> actually, a lot of times, especially on the hard difficulties, you end up doing a lot more of those cheats. And actually, that's something I needed to talk about. Oh, there was one more guy. Okay. Right. Last guy, I'll call it. The last Jedi. <laughs> yeah, uh, I just remember that, even though I'm really tempted to take the dark side ending because I, I, I really like the dark side ending. I think it's way cooler than the light side ending. I actually remember then that in the final level, you have to you have to then fight both the light and the dark side Jedi if you go down the dark path. So, yeah, it's it. So it's act. So the final level is way harder, yeah, as a on the dark side than it is on the light. I should reseal the tomb so no one else can disturb it. All right, and uh, so. Uh, Push and push. Okay, and then uh, get the sense off because oh, I should do it. Rest peacefully. And then you have to really run it, gun it to get out of the friggin' temple before it like explodes. Uh, not explodes, but it collapses here. Oh god. <laughs> I thought I fucked up there. <laughs> Jesus, oh boy, man. All right, now it's t now it's tough decision time because um, I really don't like most of these other levels that much. All right, so one of these levels. Okay, this bit level. This is the uh, freaking. Um, uh, this is the freaking. Uh, 
FPS level. And I think this might be the one that I'm going to skip because I really don't like it. This is actually a kind of a fun and cool level. Uh, so I might do it. This is the other really bullshit level. I don't want to spoil what's in for it. But I think I'll do this over Biss any day of the week. But you know what? Let's go to Orb Mantel because between sessions I actually remembered what you do in this level. And I think some other Star Wars fans are going to at least enjoy this. And I suppose we can get the final level of the Force Heal. So one of the other powers I'm going to get is that blue one. And I never actually... I, I, feel so, I feel so stupid for never actually explaining it. But the blue shield, what it does, it actually protects you from force, uh, from those force powers. So I'm only gonna get the second level of that. Huh, there's some of the weapons right there. Alright, so the mission in this is to destroy this weapons depot, this we weapon stockade that I guess the, uh, the Empire is holding on this planet. So now you're setting these bombs up, whereas previously we're breaking them down. And look who it is. It's Vile from Mega Man X. <laughs> Boba Fett. This doesn't concern you, Jedi. Just walk away. Look, I can't do that. Okay, so he's going to be flying around and pestering you through this level. And... You can fight him, but uh, can't we talk about this? I think I need to have the uh, yeah, yeah. And this is the easiest way to really deal with him. It's just you keep buzzing all your your shots back at him. Uh, but screw this mess. I'm go I'm gonna go deal with the with the explosives. On the harder difficulty levels, he is a lot harder to deal with because he uses like rocket launchers and shit on you. So, Force Speed is your friend in this level. You can't fight him, but all that happens, you can't kill him. He just keeps, uh, he just flies away when he gets low health. Alright, first checkpoint. Oh yeah, and he keeps shooting at you as well. Oh man, I need to get up there. Oh god, yeah, just barely had enough force powers. And you don't want to get too close to him, he has a flamethrower on, on his arm. And that's actually, that's kind of fitting as well, because uh, I just recently rewatched Aquaman. I got it on uh, DVD. Because Blu-ray is a piece of shit. <laughs> I genuinely do feel like that that way like yeah, if, if I'm gonna get a physical movie on physical media I'm just gonna get the, the DVD I don't care about blu-ray I mean sure the image quality is better but you know oh god he, yeah he does use the rockets here okay so I do wanna like avoid him a bit give him a little love tap there <laughs> with my saber <laughs> that's just to deter him a little bit but I don't think it actually uh, yeah. How many more bombs are there? I think at least two more, possibly three. Ooh. And this is the annoying part because you're running away from him. So he can, like, nail you while you're trying to get away. I, well, I, actually, yeah, I think you do have to then, when, once you've set up all the bombs, uh, you then do have to... Um, you do then have to actually uh, fight him for a little bit. Okay, my force is all, uh, healed up. Okay. Yeah, there's just all these holes on the... Oh, whoa, 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 I did not mean to do that. And I don't know if he kind of, like, teleports behind you. I, sometimes, I occasionally get the feeling he does. Okay, there's another bomb I have to set down here. And then I think... And then I think there's there's still one more, I think, after this. At the very back here. Alright, I'm using the force beat just because I wanna... Alright, I think that's the last one. So now I gotta get back to my ship and then I gotta finish off Boba Fett. Yeah. 
Yeah, and also, so Aquaman. Yeah, I really loved Aquaman. That was that's it's been one of my like favorite of the DC movies. I've generally liked the DC movies a lot more than uh, probably most other people. But yeah, that that one has been one of my personal favorites. I really I've really liked it. Uh, so now I gotta finish him off. And I don't want to get too far away from him because he then. Oh god! Oh god! Okay. He's not fucking around. Yeah, okay, so, you know. And the thing that I was reminded of again, is, and it's something that I actually kind of noticed already when I, before the movie came out, was that I noticed, like, how many, like, cool kind of, you know, actors who have been in, like, other comic book movies and things were in it. Like, you know. All right, I'm gonna. I'm trying to cheese this a little bit. Don't I have the rocket launcher? Where did he go? Oh, there he is. All right, that did it. I think I did get nail him a few times with the with the big blaster. Yeah, so, and also, you know, there's, so there's Django Fett, there's Nicole Kidman, who was in Batman Forever, there's Dolph Lundgren, who was He-Man, that's really cool for me. So, you met Boba Fett. I'm impressed. Luke and I'm not. <laughs> that, that's actually a really dumb mission. <laughs> and also, I don't really like Boba, Boba Fett that much, like, you know, kind of a, I'm, all, I'm of the persuasion that Boba Fett is, you know, smidge overrated as a character, but... I think we're going to start off with the Yalara for the next mission. That device is too powerful to fall into so the there is a gloaking device on this planet. All right. Uh, oh yeah, you could. Do, there, you can. You can. You could have used them force mind trick in this game, but it's really not a very practical thing. All it does is it does make some enemies uh, attack other enemies, but it's a really impractical. Like these four powers are really the best ones. Uh, force drain is just a piece of shit and force rage is completely useless so yeah force absorption this is what i'm gonna be getting and i might not get like the uh the highest levels of it or anything i just get gonna, gonna get keep, keep getting the hardest weapon so here we're gonna get the nogri uh these blue guys and yeah you're we're gonna see what this level is all about in the next episode so, we'll see you then, after this cutscene ends. Yeah, that's where we're going. Alright, so, bye-bye! Like no